Mr. Edward DeVos, you're president of the Georgia State Conference, NAACP. I am. Just last night, you went into the prison that's only a very short walk away from this church to see Troy Davis, and you spent about half an hour with him. What did he say to you? He talked to us about his innocence. He, he talked to us about making sure that we get the message out to the people on the outside, that this movement is bigger than him now, that whether they execute him or not, he wants us to continue to push to end the death penalty. Troy said to us to tell the people to keep the faith. He's in good spirits. He was not sad. In fact, he had more faith. He calmed us. What kind of man is he? Troy is a very courageous man. He's one who has stood on death row for 22 years and maintained the same story for all 22 years. I am innocent, and if they kill me, they will be killing an innocent man. We have to remember the police officer who died in this, uh, Mr. McPhail. What would you, did he talk about that at all, or do you have thoughts he, he, on that? He did, you know, he did. He said that, you know, his heart goes out for Officer Mark McPhail. As we've said all along, our prayers go out to his mother, Ms. McPhail. Troy recognized that there's a family grieving, but he also recognized in his conversation with us that he's not the one. He said to us that they can't find peace in killing him. Did he say anything else? Just at the end? Well, at the end of it, he greeted us. He told us to tell everybody he, he, uh, he loved them, and, that, and he told us that uh, he actually said, I'll see you again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much.